Hey guys, welcome to today's Let's Play. Today, um, I'm playing a new game on my channel called Observer. This game is um, probably a little over a year old. It kind of flew under the radar, I think. It's more of an indie title. But this is Observer. It's made by the same development team. Ooh, hold on a second. That is, that is some loud stuff. Ooh, that is loud. Um, it's made by the same development team that made Layers of Fear, which is like one of my favorite indie horror games that I've ever played. Um, I didn't realize it was the same team that made it, so as soon as I found that out, I was like, I have to try this game. It's been sitting in my library for a while. But you play as a detective in this cyberpunk kind of dystopian future, trying to solve a mystery. And to do it, you'll have to kind of like mind dive into the, the minds of criminals and deviants and people um, throughout the world. So it's, it's pretty cool. It's supposed to be pretty dark and pretty twisted. So I thought we'd give it a shot. I don't know anything else about this game other than that, so I thought we would just kind of go in blind um, and give it a shot. I still have other games I'm featuring on my channel simultaneously, um, Strange Brigade and We Happy Few, but I just thought we'd add something new to the mix because, you know, try and keep things for refreshing. Krakow. Okay. You there? That's us. We're Lazarski. I'm assuming. Uh, waking up. So we're taking a little nappy nap. Lazarski, uh, there? Ooh, holy. Ooh. This, this man has his head on a swivel. That is super, super sensitive. Hold on a second. That's a lot better. Okay. Uh, interact. Hi. Yeah, I'm here. You okay there? I've been hailing you for the past five minutes. That is way I better. I must have dozed off. Whew. No rest for the wicked. How's the dream meter treating you? Well, I'm not vegetable yet. Could have fooled That's me. good, I guess. Hardy are. I'm serious, Dan. Your signal's all over the place. Have you taken your meds? Uh... Don't worry about it. In a moment. Do it now. I need you in good shape. Just trying to check your status and synchronize. Okay, so that's us. Daniel Lazarski is actually played by veteran actor Rutger Howard, in case you're worried about it. In case you, you thought you recognized him from somewhere. Alright, so we took some drugs. Dope, dope. There you go. Looking better already. Yeah. Wouldn't want me to mess up. Can you see the headlines? Another leech goes berserk. Don't be like that. It's just... Yeah. Um... Any What's work for me? About? Just checking in, or you need me downtown? Nah, just a checkup. No one left for you to interrogate. Sounds pretty bad. Yep, not pretty. The explosion leveled half a block. The place is still on fire. Corporate goons all over the place, securing the area. Hmm. Covering the tracks, you mean? Ooh, it got super dark. Careful what you say. This is a monitor channel. Who is this? How'd you get this frequency? Don't you recognize me? Adam? Yes. Well, what's left of me? Dad. What happened? Where where have you been all this time? Away from you. It's funny. Thought it would be easier to hear your voice after all these years. But it really isn't. Come on, Adam, don't start. I really thought I could pull it off, you know? It was so close difference setting us all free but now it's can't be for nothing it doesn't matter tell me where you are i'll come and get you shit dad for once in your life just listen to me whatever happens i need you to remember you're not in control adam okay me you still there? Adam. God damn it. Dad? Dad. Me? 
Oh, look at that. That's cool. We can see ourselves in the rear view, moving our head. Okay. Sorry, back to the game. I just thought that was really cool. Triangulating coordinates. Come on. Location established. Tenement building. Class C history. Jesus. Adam, the stacks. You just had to hit bottom, huh? Okay, so I guess the mystery we're trying to solve is what's going on with our Rock son. Fucking bottom. Mm. Rutger Hauer is not happy about this. I'm excited for this game. It's supposed to be pretty twisted. That's like my thing. That's my jam. I like the imagery so far. Kind of weird fuse between biology and technology. This is cool. This is a cool intro. Cool. Right. All right, hold on. I gotta. This is gonna drive me nuts. The sensitivity thing. Okay, that's better. This is manageable. Before it was unmanageable. Hi, little cleaning robot. What? Are you just vacuum my foot or something? Uh, hi. Friend, can I interact with you? What's that? That's the crouch button. Uh, what is, how do I talk to you? You need to get out. I'm not looking for trouble. Oh, then I'm there. Uh, yeah. Sort of. Name. Uh, Grabinski? Who's Grabinski? Lazarski? Lazarski. Oh, did he maybe take? Did he maybe take another name, like his mother's name or something? Sure. Check again. Tenant, name. Maybe Grabinski. Leon Grabinski. Tenant. Apartment seven. Ground floor. Through the courtyard. Turn right. Turn left. Straight ahead. Turn right. Yeah, I got it. Backwards and forwards. Thanks. Mm, door open. Gosh, I, I hope you got it, Daniel. I did not get it. Oh, look, he's got a little graffiti on him. This is cool. I like this. This is neato. All right, we can kind of move a little bit quicker. Okay, uh, uh push the door. Is this where we're going? Eh. All right, courtyard. This is a really cool visual style. Wow. I feel like I'm in Blade Runner. This is neat. I am super into this. Okay, there's a, a tattoo shop. I'm sorry, I'm taking all of this in. I know we're supposed to be, like, investigating, but... This is cool. All right, um, boop. 
All right, so we're going to apartment seven, I think you said. So we're here. I'm gonna go up the stairs and bank a left, I think. I think you said we're going to apartment seven. This is apartment number one. Or 17. One. Yeah, I guess. All right, so we're going up. Can't go down there. This is really cool. I was not sure what to expect with this game. Oh, no. Is it closed off to us? Eh. Uh. Two. Okay, here we go. I got it. Hello? Who's growling at me? Hello? Five. Uh, number seven, eight, seven, right? You know what we said? Hello? I'm here. Uh, uh. What's going on? here get wrecked is that our son or is that some other dude oh he has no head oh this guy's got no head Yeah, it doesn't have to be our son. Yeah, could be anybody. He's got no head. Um, cool. This is Lazarski 65621 setting up a crime scene. Um, what is this, like a... A baton or something? Activate electromagnetic vision. I need to check the victim's compact. Six million volts. Wasn't enough. Hmm. And analyze victim's compass. Oh, it's a stun baton. Okay. Structural damage detected. Uh. Is there anything else I should be using? This is weird. This is kind of like um, like Batman detective mode, but weirder. Uh. H N. Got this thing. Okay. Somewhere. Okay, so that's the compass. Uh, what's this? There's like a little thing over there, like a blood stain. The is equipped with an ID mixer. Identification not possible. Damn it. Okay. Uh, here. No. All right. Can I? Can I move? I can't move. We did the scratches. Oh, that? No, that's more blood. Is there something up here? No. Oh, now we can move. Okay, we just had to. We had to kind of look at some stuff before we can we could advance. Got it. Game looks really good. Um, what's that? Synchrozine, powerful augmentation stabilizer. Okay. Cool. What else? Um, or anything else in the bathroom? I don't think so. There's some stuff in here though, in like the kitchen area. Can I close? Thank you. Mm. All right. Let's see. Uh, open. Open. Um, I don't know what it is I'm looking at. What are we looking at? What's happening? Over here? Uh, 
no? Printed on real paper. Nineteen eighty four, huh? How how very cliche. Uh what's the difference between EM vision? Wait, hold on. I have two different vision modes? Oh I would not even be paying attention. I have I have electromagnetic vision, I guess, and biovision. It's a processor. Okay. So got it. Okay. So I have I have two different vision modes I'm supposed to be using. That's why. That's why some stuff is showing up and some is not. Got it. Alright, so then what if, let's use electromagnetic vision in here. Um you like this? What's that? The hidden data storage. The encryption is too complex for my hacking tool. Oh. Taking it with me. Let's take Might it with you. Decode it later. Adam, so this is your apartment. Doesn't mean it's your body. Right. Um, holographic frame. Is the blurred out face supposed to be us? This. What's that? Bingo. Code. I don't have a code. Can I hack you? Connection established. Question mark. Question mark. Question mark. Four. Well, gosh. That's super helpful. So I know there's a four. Huzzah. I know that the last code ends in a four, but what am I supposed to be like, like looking at? 1984? That's the only number I've seen in this entire apartment. If it's not 1984, I'm gonna have to look it up. Ah! I was like, what? What am I even doing? I was like, what is the damn code? Um, okay. So what did that get us? Um, right. What's this? More synchrozine. Cool. And then tragic accident or insurgent attack. There's some documents. Corrupted, 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 corrupted. Emails? They know. I know you're a busy man and all, but we gotta talk now. I think they're on to me. For real this time, I'm almost certain someone followed me home yesterday, and today I saw this weird guy outside my window. Just standing there. If you can't guarantee my safety, then I'm out. I got enough problems as it is. H.N. And H.N. is the name that we found on the, the dead guy, I think. Yeah. The guy without the head. He's H.N. As far as our little mule goes, don't worry, I can manage her. She's not like us. She knows she's in over her head, and it clearly terrifies her. You can't expect too much from a simple mind. For now, just focus on your work and leave the human relations aspect of our project to me. For the time being, calm down and maintain focus. Eyes on the prize, J. P.S. Glad you like the piece. I think it captures the essence of what we're trying to accomplish. Uh. Kind of accident insurance attack. Mental explosion toward insurance. Krakow. Um. Okay, there's an explosion caused by a reactor malfunction in the business district in Krakow, downtown. Insurgents were indeed behind the attack through a the registry. Okay. So there was an explosion in a building thought to be caused. Oh, open I gate? He activated the apartment security system, leaving the crime scene. Really? That was it? Wow, that took entirely too long. I really hope that the entire game is not going to be like this. Alright, who is this? Wait, hold on. Who are... Wait! Get out of your vision. Who is this? A glitch in the system. A brief history of the nanophage. Okay. Anything else that I need to, I need to take? I'll take the synchrozine. Synchrozine refilled. Okay, I don't know what synchrozine is. Is it, is it matter to me? Is this something I'm going to need later? I don't know. 
All right, so now we can get out of the apartment because we've unlocked the door. That took entirely too long. I could not figure out that code. Feel right. You're still alive. No way. And await further instruction. Uh, what is going on? Why is there an alarm going off? What? Well, I'm pretty concerned about what's going on. What? It is, it is dark. I don't know where I'm going. Where am I going? Excuse me? Can I? Is there somewhere I can go for safety? Can someone help me, please? Everything's closed. I can go in this disgusting bathroom. Ew. This is gross. This is a gross bathroom. What is the purpose of this bathroom? This is the only room I can go in. Is it just to be grossed out by what's in here? Hey, you. Okay. Come here, quick. Uh, hi. What is We're shaking. It? What's up with the lockdown? Is it the phage? Was there an outbreak? Um, Too early I don't know. To tell. I'm looking into it right now. Looking into it? Are you out of your mind? We might all be infected. You don't know that. Best thing we can do is stay calm and... And let them come and slaughter us? I won't let them take me. I won't. You do, you do. You do you, friend. You do what you gotta do. KPD, I need to ask you some questions. Do you know what's going on? My holo projection got cut off. I, I can't get a signal. The building is under lockdown. No external connection. Not much we can do. Shit. Sounds serious. So, uh, you wanted to ask me something? Sure. I wanted to ask you about the tenant you know, in your seven. Apartment seven. Seven? I didn't even know anyone lived there. Uh, hey. You wouldn't happen to know when they're gonna fix the connection. Not that it's like super important to me or anything. I just need to know. Um, uh, might I'm take not some time. Sure Who knows? Anyone even knows we've been locked in. It might take a while. Oh God. I mean, sure, that's fine. It's just, you know, the apartment feels very small all of a sudden. Kind of claustrophobic. <sighs> Is it hot in here? I'm sweating something awful. Just take, take a, a deep breath. Yeah. It's take a breath there, fun. friend. Of Relax. Why wouldn't it be? I'm just gonna sit here and wait for them to fix it. Can you talk to me some more? It makes it kind of easier. Um. What can you mm, tell me? What do you want to talk about? Yeah. Um. Uh, yeah. You know. Do a little uh, subtle investigation. You an AMA fan? Uh, not really. Sounds like you are. Of course I don't know who won since my projector went out. <sighs> Why are my hands shaking? Uh, uh previous lockdowns? Oh, well, I, uh, uh, it must have been at least seven or eight years. Have I had a lockdown before? Um, I don't think so. I don't remember my projector going off, ever. Okay, and now you're wasting my time. I don't have time for this. Oh, okay. Uh, I understand. It's no problem. I'll just sit here alone. God, I'm really starting to sweat like a pig. <laughs> Hang in there. Yeah, you're a little bit nutty. You're a little nuts, number three. Cool, so we're just going to kind of like interrogate all these people through their apartment doors? There's a lot of pigeons in here. Weird pigeons. You look funky. Um, so I wonder if this whole game takes place in this apartment building. I don't know what the playthrough time is on this. I'm not sure what the environments are like. Uh, number eight? What? Hey. What do you want? Got a minute, sir. KPD. Oh, God. They're here. The cleaners are here. Uh, huh? Who are the cleaners? Is this a new area where we threw here before? No? Nobody's home? Come to the door, please. Oh, hi. Just want to talk. Who are you? D 
Did Chiron send you? I'm with the KPD, if that's what you're asking. Seriously? We haven't had a cop around these parts in... ever, I guess. Well, you've got one now. Yeah, good luck. You're gonna fucking need it. Thanks. Thanks for your abundance of help. Appreciate it. You guys are all jerks. Uh, what is this? Is another motherboard? An RC device. Okay. Door. Door unlocked. Is this someone's home? Hello, I'm in your house. KPD. Don't believe there are lies. The plague is still out there. Delivered mail notification. The following message cannot be delivered. My dear Annie, by the time you read this, I will no longer be among the living. The details are not important. Just know that I went out on my own terms. I don't want to ask for a proper burial. God knows you don't owe me anything, and by the time the cleaners are done with the place, I doubt there will be anything left of me to bury. Just know that for all my faults, I have always loved you, just like I loved your mother. When the disease took her, part of me died that day. Simple displays of affection became a foreign concept, a painful reminder of what I had lost. It's not justify what I've put you through, but it is the truth. I'm so happy you managed to get out of this hellhole and find someone worthy of your love. I wish you both all the best. Dad. Cool. No documents. Uh, with fire and sword. Spiders? <gasps> Shut up! These bloody spiders again! Ah! We can play like a little game. Uh, yeah! Do I get a sword? I do. Yeah! Uh, I made it. Play again. Or do I have to go back to the main menu? Level 2? <laughs> this is cool. Ah, take that spider. All right, so I need. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Aha! But I'm out of swords. Ah, 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 ah. Yeah! That's cute. I guess I can only go up two levels. Huh. All right. That's a fun little diversion. Um, okay. So, so the dad is, is dead, whoever was living here? With fire and sword, spiders. Um, should I be looking for anything mechanical, electronic? Oh, uh, well, we already did this. I guess I can't, can I scan it? Yeah, I can scan it. Still getting used to the controls. So it's personal computer, easy. Um, what else? Is there any bio stuff? No. But, uh, what does that say? Remove, remove something. Remove your implant? Remove your implant. What was that? Did I miss something? Um, uh, I don't know what just happened. He just dropped an F-bomb for whatever reason. It says remove your implant. It doesn't say anything else. I can't open the doors. Fine. Fine. Whatever. Hmm. Uh, this way, I guess. I don't think we went this way, right? Jonathan left the door open. Hello? So, this is cool. I'll take more of this. Refilled. Uh. Computer? I'm not sure what scanning these things does for me, but I'm going to scan everything. I'm going to scan it all. Uh, I don't see anything else in here. Okay. Marp. Anything in the lockers? Marp. Nope. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Nanophage and I. Okay. The little fan. Can I can I turn these on? What is this? A metal? 
like a war dog tag. I don't think I can scan these for anything. No. All right, so let's turn this on. The wall stands tall. Our brave boys and girls can you defend us from the eastern, eastern hordes. Press denial, dear Mr. Well, we really appreciate your exemplary service. Uh, the VRI policy force is surely proactive stance on helping our brave veterans reintegrate with society. First, indeed, a permanent B-class employment. Oh, wait. Uh, circumstances, we must sadly deny your claim and are therefore forced to terminate your participation in the program. As of today, the Veteran Pension Fund will no longer cover periodic maintenance of your cybernetic prosthetics. Hmm. What well, sucks? Uh, I don't give a crap anymore. One more message and I'll find you and beat the junk out of you. What? I'm telling you over and over again that her husband and my father died 18 years ago. To live in the past. For the last time, Mike Javorski is dead. He's been dead for a long time. Someone type that into your busted ass head of yours. Oh, okay. Oh. So, got it. Alright, so this message is for somebody's dad who died 18 years ago. Got it. Um, ground floor. Ooh, this tells us who lives in the ground floor. Leon Grabinski. So, question. So we asked the guy on the ground floor for Leon Grabinski's apartment. That's who lives in number seven. Who is Leon Grabinski? I wonder. Tom Sadowski, Stanislaw, Igor, Marion. All right. Of course. Two agents. Helena Novak, apartment 104, and Hannah Nader. Also on the same floor. Okay, 104 and 106. We'll remember that. Got it. Okay. Oh, you have fire and sword too? Oh, you're on level three. Um cool. Alright, so 104 and 106. I guess that's where we're going now. So is there anything else to do in here? No, 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 no. What the hell? <gasps> Not a good idea to sneak up on me, you know. We need to do get out. Um, I tenant register? The tenant register. Authorized personnel only. Well, I was in a I'm a cop. And the door was open. Authorized per 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 personnel only. Uh, okay. Business. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> I know what you are. Oh, uh, yeah? What's that? During war, took one alive. Sent for one. Now few. you. To get into his head. Uh, I'm not a threat. I'm gonna snap. Don't be. They don't even let us carry guns anymore. <laughs> not worried. Bust. Glory. Bust. Most things. Uh, you, you fought in the in war? The big one. Is that why you got all this junk in you? Plasma sweep. Hit our convoy. Barreled through armor. Sorry, I didn't mean to bring back your memory. Um, okay, what about you Adam? About Do you know my son? Helen in apartment seven. Tenant. Yeah, Tenant. How long has he been living there? Yeah. Maybe longer. Not good with time. You ever talked to him? Didn't get out much. None of them do. Okay. Right, men. Let me know if it comes back to you. Um, lockdown. The lockdown. Mm. Trying to get it open. Rudy and I. You think it might be the nanophage? You had any recent outbreaks? No. Last one. Long time ago. Down by the river. Old implants. Bad implants. 
Uh, who's Rudy? Rudy's the robot. Multifunction service and maintenance. Drone. Don't lose it. What? Mm. Wander off. Sometimes. Mm. Need to track manually. This guy's weird. Can we lift the lockdown from the inside? Also, it looks so, like uh, as I move, as I move him around, everything gets fuzzy. I wonder if no. that's. If that's supposed to happen, like if I'm like panicking or something, you can see as I move him across, everything looks like kind of glitchy. How that last one used to work. I need to get going. I'm heading out. Can you give me full access to the building? Assistance. Unstable. Unlocked. What I could. Thanks. You better stay here. There might be some very nasty people out there. Nasty. Uh, huh. Bad. Look, just stay safe. You know what? I never got your name. I'm Dan. Huh? Name. Sorry I gave you a hard time earlier. Good to meet you. Janus. Weird. Yeah, it looks like if I'm if I'm wandering around, everything looks like all pixelated. Like I'm wondering if that's like an effect of something or or what that would be. Like, do I need to take my drugs? Do I need to take a pill? Yes. <clears throat> Sinker scene injected. Strain level decreased. Oh, maybe that's what it is. Yeah, it looks a little bit better now. I think I think when I get stressed, things get weird. Yeah, we're good now. We're good. All right. So, how do I know when my when my stress is up? How do I know? Synchronization. Oh, I'm not really sure about that. I see that little pill with the green meter next to it. I'm assuming that means something. But now it looks good. Okay, um, so I guess Janus opened up some more pathways for us, so we want to go, hi, hi little robot friend, is Rudy, service drone, um, I think we want to go to apartments 104 and 106 on the ground floor, isn't that what we said? Uh... Okay, tattoo shop. I don't. Uh, no, on the ground floor. We want to go to the first floor, right? Oh, no. Ooh, that's. What is that? That is terrifying. That is terrifying to see. Yeah, up here, 104 and 106. Yeah. Um, 105 to 110. Here. Right now. Yes? No, wait. Here. 101 to 104. Okay. Hey! One oh. You! I can hear you out there. Help me, please. What's wrong? Problems? Oh, I heard this awful noise. What's going on? There's been a lockdown. A lockdown? No. Oh, God, please, not today. Well, today. What's so special about today? I was scheduled to undergo a, a medical procedure. It's a private matter. I'd, I'd, I'd rather not talk about it. Okay. Help yourself. Um, are, are you, you in pain? Okay? Sounds like you're in pain. Well, it's fine. I'm just. I got a, a condition. I, I'm waiting to have it fixed. Mm -hmm. Anything I can do? <laughs> sure, if you're an expert in corrective surgery. I am not, but I could do without the sarcasm. Sir, I'm wondering if you've seen anything suspicious lately. I haven't seen anything in over 40 years. Ah, that's your condition. I, 
I, I, I really don't feel comfortable talking about this. Okay. Fine, I won't waste your time then. Hey, wait. I did hear something. Quiet footsteps, deliberate, heavy breathing, angry, not hiding, hunting. Hmm. Anything else? The smell. It seemed uh, oddly familiar. Reminded me of my childhood. Your childhood? Yes. My family lived outside the city with all manner of creatures. When it would rain, the smell would be similar. Hmm. Like an animal smell? They stunk like animals? Is that what you're trying to say? It's another gross bathroom? These bathrooms are awful. I hate this. Ugh. Ugh. That's the scariest thing so far about this game. In those bathrooms. Um. It's like some sort of electrical junction box. We want apartment 104. This one. Hello? Can you, can you hit this please? And the door's open. Anyone here? Um. What is that sound? Um. Okay. So you're dead. Oh, not dead. But your entrails are hanging out, friend. Don't be afraid. I'm here to help. What happened? What happened? Can you like scroll it in blood? Listen to help me, me find who did this. The building's on lockdown. There's no way I can help you now. But I can get whoever's responsible for this if you help me find him. No. Don't try to uh, talk. There's another way. We're gonna do like a mind dive. Okay. That's so right. Uh all right. Uh, all right, there it is. Uh, push triangle to connect. This is Amir Nowak. Approved. Commencing neural interrogation. Cool. All right. So now we're like in his head. Hey, baby. This is cool. Uh, where are we going in here? Oh, it is pretty neat. All right, Amir, doors open. This you? is this is Amir. Yeah, Amir's apartment. Wait, what? 104, this is where we just went into, isn't it? What? Um... Huh? The door's locked. What? Huh? Where are we going? Every time I walk in here, the water stops. Is that significant to me in some way? Uh, can I like close the door with me in here? No. This is weird. I can't use my scanners or anything. Oh, we just had to wait a minute. What? This is weird. Uh, okay. <laughs> should I be should I be looking at something? Should I be interacting with something? What what should we be doing? Cuz this is strange. 
That's for sure. Okay, there we go. I just had to, I had to crouch. Um, this is weird. Look at all the scribbles on the walls. Hello? Uh huh. This is trippy. I like this. I wasn't sure I was gonna feel about this game. They should have really led with this. This should have been like the opener. Uh. Should I be going this way? This is the way I came, isn't it? Oh, it's like. Oh. This is very unusual. What? All I want to know is who killed you. Why are you taking me through this mind trip? I just want to know who who stabbed you. Who ripped your guts out? Just tell me. Just tell me. That's all I want to know. Uh... No, I don't think we're going here. Thanks, kid. This should get me through the week. Okay. I'm assuming we're following these green arrows. So weird. Uh. We can go this way too, but I, I should probably be following those green arrows, huh? I'm just, I want to explore. Like, this is really, really weird. So we're like navigating through this guy's mind right now. Um. What the fuck, man? I told you not to show up during the day. Okay. So I guess I triggered something. Um. The floating stuff. Ah, I kicked the bucket. Fun. Is is out there. Um, sure. Okay. Close that up. Uh, I'm just kind of wandering. Uh. What is it I should be looking for? Am I just am I just wandering around until stuff gets triggered? Okay. Uh 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 What is that? I don't want to meet that. I don't want to meet you. Uh... I don't want to go in here. I don't want to go in there. I don't want to go in here. Is this thing like... Is there like an actual monster patrolling this, this dream? Am I, in, am I in actual danger here? I don't have a life bar. Oh no, auto saving. The game just auto saved. Um. Oh, all I want this guy to do is tell me who, who tried to kill him. Why has this got to be a whole big thing? What does that sound? Is that a is that a garbage can? Is that this garbage can? Here. Did I do good? Yeah, this is like this. I think this is the same room. 
Now, th oh, oh, and now there's no, wait. Now there's no garbage can. There's a shelf and, and a chair, this one. Did I do good? Yeah, okay, I get it. Okay, we're following like a pattern. We're trying to find the clues. So now there's like a blinking light and a light bulb. You're a, you're a pipe. Where is that? I don't, I don't see that at all. This one? There's no door here. Oh no, there is. There's one right here. Idiot. Hi. Hello. All right. And the bars with the control panels. Uh, this one? I think we're doing this right. I hope so. Yeah, I guess. This fucking slop again. Cold soup. I dig in. It's not getting any better. Huh? So I, I guess we're I guess we're like reliving this guy's memories or we're in his subconscious or something. I'm not I'm not entirely certain. It's weird. I like it. I hope we get to do more of this. Yeah, this is cool. Hello? This guy, I guess, escaped from jail. That's what's happening. Hence the barking dogs. And the being chained up. Captured again. This is so weird. Um, uh, hi. This is really cool, guys. I'm hoping it translates well to video, because this is this is super weird, but I like it. I honestly was not sure what to expect with this game. This is like a head trip, man. Um Okay. There's like some prisoners down there. Some like riot cops. The sound design is really good. I feel unnerved. <laughs> I keep jumping every time they they decide to, to transition to a new memory or whatever. It comes out of nowhere. Oh. It's, this is super unsettling. And they're like beating prisoners. I want to make sure I don't miss anything. Like I feel like there's all these little little subtle scenes and, and sounds and stuff. I want to make sure I'm not missing anything good. Fresh meat. Oh, this is cool. I can't I can't turn around. It won't let me turn around. Uh Look, dude, all I wanna know is who stabbed you. That's it.
Just tell me who stabbed ya. Let me out of here. <laughs> oh, those were the tally marks. The tally marks were like how long he spent in prison, I guess. What is going on? What? What? This is... What is happening? I am... I am genuinely confused. But like, in a good way. This is really... This is freaking me out. What? What the hell? Amir, do you remember the night we met? It's hard to forget. <laughs> Guys, this is really cool. Are you scared of me? No, I could see right through you. I saw that underneath all your muscles and tattoos, you were like a big wounded animal, lost, alone. Hey. <laughs> At least you knew what you were getting into. Yeah, I guess, guess I, I did. did. And now Mir is dead. We're dying. Jacked Ink Tattoo Shop. That's here in this building, right? sickness and in health forsaking all others to have and to hold from this day forward until death do us part. oh they got married in a tattoo no they didn't they got married in a church but he's mixing his memories up i'm assuming i really like this mechanic i really hope we get to do more of this with more people all right these are all these are all closed. Good. We have doors. We're back to door opening. We have some semblance of normalcy. That was so cool. Um. Hmm? Come in. Don't tell me what I can and can't do. Oh, we go over here? What's over here? Uh... Okay. What's that? So. Yeah. So we're like navigating this guy's subconscious right now, trying to find the information that we need. And I guess it's like a labyrinth. We gotta kind of make our way through all these memories. To try and find the one piece of information that we need. Who who killed them? You have to try. Do it for me. For us. A lot of showers. I wonder if that has some sort of significance.
like the prison shower or something. I'm assuming all of this has some sort of relevance to his mind, his memories. Okay, where are we? Are we are we back in your apartment? What is this? These are like inhalers or something? Beer cans? I can't tell. Um there's something all over the floor. There's a bunch of clutter. Uh, is this room 104 again? No, it's another shower. Dan, we're Dan. Take your drugs. <coughs> Neural interrogation aborted. Subject expired during questioning. Emergency ah. extraction procedure successful. Got it. He died when we were in his mind. And I don't think we got the information we needed. There was a lot of stuff in there. Alright, yeah. Yeah, so when we're when we're stressed, I am an observer. When we're stressed, the screen gets all glitchy, so we need to we need to take our drugs. Um, take pill. Cool. All right. So, is there is there anything else you need to find on this dude? Morphine, some on the counter painkillers. The hmm. numbers on them might lead me to Amir's clients. Okay, and more synchrosine. Cool. All right, what else is there to explore in here? That was really cool. I want more of that. The detective part is cool. I want to, I want to dive into more people's minds. That was super neat. Well, well, you must be Helena. What else am I hiding in here? Yeah, Helena was the was H N. That's how we're looking for. Those are the initials we found in the apartment, apartment seven. Um. What is this, a computer? Work with Chiron. Uh, mails. Showing again. First off is your tiny tattoo artist. I must advise you to stop sending me these messages. Problem comes to me at the shop. Secondly, the piece on your neck was healing up fine last time I saw it. This is your claim. Uh, most of this has to do with your incessant scratching and tampering. Last time, leave it alone. Um. Gibrano was partially corrupted. Um. Okay, a favor. Sorry, Hella, I know we go back a ways, but I really can't help you this time. I wish I could, but Amir's ongoing health issues, a higher up No C classes, especially no ex-cons. Hmm, okay. Uh, Amir Noak. Details. Oh, this is like his, uh, his resume. Cool. Okay, she was trying to get him a job. He's an ex-con. She was trying to find him work for him. And you have the game, too. You're all the way on level four. Helena. Okay. So we did our first sweep. Is there anything we can find here? Like blood and scratches and wounds. On his left hand. This could help me find the woman I'm looking for. All right. We have a lacerated wound. Uh, What's this? A controlled substance. Um, Some strange looking hair. Not human. Not animal. Weird. Okay. 
And that one guy said that he heard the the blind dude said he heard some weird animal like thing lurking, lurking in the hallways. So I wonder if he was killed by a person or something else. We saw something weird in that dream. That definitely wasn't a person. That big hulking thing. Um, some sort of credit chip. Uh, holographic frame. Personal computer. Uh, all right. Um, any other bio stuff? That we need to examine. I just want to make sure I'm not missing anything. Anything vital. Yeah, we got that. We got that. We got that. What's this? More blood? More blood. Lousy ink. Hmm. Probably got him in prison. Right, right. Got the blood. Anything else we're missing? More holographic frames. Um. No, no, no. Okay. Uh, oh, wait, what's this? Nothing. I lied. Okay. Can we go up? Was this blood here before? Mm, still fresh. Leaving hmm. the crime scene. Pursuing the lead. The victim's wife could still be in the building. Maybe the neighbors know something. Maybe. That was really cool. I think we're um I think we're gonna pause here for today because we've been playing for a little over an hour, but um that was really neat. I I really didn't know what I was gonna be getting into with this game, but you can definitely tell that whoever made Layers of Fear had that same kind of trippy, weird, screw-with-your-mind mentality when they were making this game, because that was really bizarre. Um, anyway, <clears throat> this has been episode one of Observer. If you like this video, feel free to give it a like and subscribe for more like this. And I'll be playing some more of this throughout the week. Um, I'm not sure how long the playthrough time is. Could be four or five episodes. I'm not really sure. I don't think it's a full-length game, because it wasn't a full feature price. But stick with the series if you like it. Anyway, I appreciate y'all watching, and I will catch you for the next one. Peace!